Yeah, Laurie Perry's calling for an investigation into what he calls an epic failure in terms of security that led to the deadly shooting, which left one dead and injured three others, including former President Donald Trump. He also says that the political discourse has to improve. The motive behind the assassination attempt on former President Donald Trump may not yet be known, but Congressman Scott Perry says what happened was unacceptable. You, know, you think you're going to see the you know candidate for president of the United States of America, there should be no safer place on the planet, right? Even though it's not clear what the gunman's motivation for opening fire on the stage was, Perry says everyone should consider softening their political rhetoric. I think it's an opportunity to kind of take stock of where we are as a country, as a community, politically. And Perry says that goes for himself as well. Make mistakes. Uh, we all do that. Uh, and, and just like everybody else, I have as well. But I am mindful of the words that I use and the tone, and I try and keep it above board. You want to make your point. And what about the rhetoric sometimes used by the former president? It's hard to imagine anybody that's personally attacked on a daily basis for every single thing. You know, we're all human, right? But but I think it is um, telling that he, after the events on Saturday, he said he went back and he rewrote or looked at rewriting, I don't know how much portions or maybe all of his speech upcoming at the convention. Now, Perry is running for re-election. I did reach out to his Democratic opponent, Janelle Stelson's campaign, to see if they had any comment regarding what happened over the weekend. We did not hear back, but I should note that she did condemn the violence in a statement on social media after it happened and said she was praying for the former president and those at the rally. Tom Lehman, WGAL News 8.